We're very, very happy that you, Sam Peng, are back from another magnificent Eurovision. performance Thank in Eurovision. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Great to be back. Firstly, How'd you go? Well, can I ask her, who did who uh, did you have sit in my spot last week? It was Santo. Santo, Santo. Chilaro. Santo Chilaro? Yeah. Oh, I'm glad you gave a young up-and-coming kid a <laughs> chance at the... Uh, <laughs> what a brave decision by this show. Yeah, he did uh, well. Matt, I was away at Eurovision. It's great to be back. What was it like? Well, it was amazing. Uh, hopefully everyone knows. Australia, uh, uh, Ukraine won. Yeah. Uh, Australia and Damien came second. Second? And second, but... She let herself down, she let her country down. <laughs> that is rubbish! What was it like being a, an Australian at Eurovision? It was a privilege to be there, but I'll tell you what, I can give you the definitive example of what it's like to be an Aussie at Eurovision. I was, I was in the commentary box in Sweden. The grand final had just been finished. Ukraine had won, Dami comes second, Justin Timberlake was like the halftime entertainment. Yep. The commentary was over, I turned my phone on, and the first text message I got said, Bernie Vince reported again. <laughs> <laughs> Please make welcome. 18 games, should have been more. 23 goals, should have been more. Please make it well. Ryan Fitzgerald, everybody. <laughs> Great to see uh, that you're continuing the theme of the, the uh, most yeah. courageous Thank footballers you. of all time, Glenn Archer on to Ryan Fitzgerald. So thanks, <laughs> thanks for having me, guys. Mate, can we go right back to the very beginning, if you don't mind? Big Brother, what was it like? <laughs> what, what, uh, what was it like being locked in the house? Well, it, it was scarier than playing my first AFL game, that's was for it? sure. So my, my first day at the Sydney Swans uh, was, you know, I was quite nervous and I got a tour of the change rooms and I, I said to them, is it all right if I go off on my own and just have a look around? So I, I, I went off and I could hear this cheering down at the end of the change rooms and, um, and I looked around the corner and there was Paul Kelly, Dale Lewis, Darren Creswell, like legends of yes. the club. Yeah, yeah. And they were all standing up. It was a standing ovation. They were all clapping. I thought, what are they clapping? clapping at. Turn around the corner and Tony Lockett was out the front with a cricket bat holding it up as if he'd made a ton. It actually got a ton on his skin folds. He'd come, <laughs> he'd come back from off season so sort of large that he got a ton and everyone was giving him a standing ovation. You mentioned uh, uh, Peter Bazasto was a previous guest on this show. Ooh. Now you, you bailed me up. You were very upset because Buzz, we handed him a uh, Player. A we are handing him a trophy because mm. we thought he was a, a very deserving a member of the 65 game and under club yep. with Spot the team on. of the century. Yep. And you, you were very upset. D very disappointed I didn't make the team. Oh. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, not, not even considered. Was um, he in the conversation? No. No, right. <laughs> I mean, Bazusto probably kicked the greatest goal of all time, that one he smothered, turned around and snapped. Just but... ask him, yes. by the way, just ask him. <laughs> yeah, we want to write this wrong, by the way, so we've got a new team of the century. Right. It's for the 20 games and under uh, AFL team of the century. Right, right. 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 It's been great to have you on the show. We've yeah, been wanting you to get you down here for a long, Thank long time you. to celebrate your glorious career. Thanks for coming down Thanks and being part of it. One of the great blokes of the biz. Ryan Fitzgerald, everybody, please. Thank you for coming on the show. Out goes Sam Ping this week. Please make welcome Santo Chilaro. And I understand this is your first time in a pub. How good Ever. is this? This is fantastic. Do they all smell like this? <laughs> this is great. G'day, everybody. Welcome to the Friday Front Bar here at the All Nations Hotel. Thanks to the Brewery Fresh Carlton Draft, the number one draft beer in Australia. Andy Martin, Nicholas, right. Sam Pang. Yeah.